one of them. I'll take the other. You got a throw in that? Just go for one. I'll get the other. That was clean. Okay, let's move. Up ahead, another one on patrol. Bueno, no me acuerdo dónde es ahora mismo. <risa> o a lo mejor no, he, no era este. También puede ser. Bueno, se intentó. No, 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 Tan buena no serás entonces. Si te dejo con uno. Hija de mi vida. También te digo, ¿es ¿eh? aquí, hija de puta? ¿Cabrona? Sin vergüenza. Seguir, no ves que estoy delante tuya. 
Vale, pues no sé Espera, toma por culo Yo voy corriendo a ellos. Ya es distinto. Creo que el juego no, 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 no tiene muy, muy a la labor que dejes vivo al tío este. Me da a mí, eh. Vámonos. Hostia. Vale, 
I need to relieve myself. There'll be a bucket in your cell. Here we go. I'm serious. Yep, and so am I. Hit him, John, please. Hey, you don't need to do that just because she told you to. I don't need to be hit. I just want to be treated civil. Shut it. You heard the lady. Thank you. I still protest my innocence. This woman ripped me out of my bed, kidnapped me, then let Langton kidnap me, then you killed them all and kidnapped me back. I'm the victim here. Damn you. John, would you be so kind as to shut him up? Don't listen to her. Now, let me speak my piece. There's no call to hit me, mister. Yes, listen to him Lord. squirm. Jesus. I no le voy a pegar. I can see now it has its rewards. That's a whole lot easier with a partner. That back there, you didn't need a partner. You needed a whole company behind you. We did fine. And with Langton and his men gone, there'll be more demand for our service. <laughs> Sadie, you know I'm a rancher now. Mostly. And I know how you're paying for your ranch. Don't spread that around. Here we are. Grab him and bring him in, John. Sure. You're a bitch and a bastard. We brought in Shane Finley. Oh, great. Let's uh, put him in the cell. Objective. Just put him on the bed. We're gonna watch you swing. What for? I didn't do anything. Nothing. It's yeah, all yeah. I thought you said you lost him. Well, I did, but we got him back. Oh, and James Langton's dead. We killed him. Why'd you do a thing like that? It was him that robbed me. Okay. Here. There's a decent price on Finley. Mm-hmm. I know. <laughs> you want this money to go to the bank, too? No, I'll, uh, I'll take it myself. <laughs> okay, Jim Milton. It's John Marston here. All right, well, if you need any more work, you can find me in town. Or maybe I'll find you. I'm retired. Sure. <laughs> Be well, John. Oye, 200 pavos de trabajo. Come on, lady. Eh. What in the Hay una segunda. What's going on in there? Huh? Herman Zeisendorf! I've been framed! You want to take a bullet for a petty crime? Stop! There is no crime! Hey, hey, Careful, I sprung. 
Venga, lo tengo, lo tengo. Mía. Let's make sure you can't run off anywhere else. Listen. Is it okay if I rob you? You really don't need to do that. Be gentle. Vámonos. This one dead to rights, didn't I, Mr. Zeisendorf? Mr. Chief, I took a wander through construction. It's a mistake. Enough of you. Put that German in the cage. Uh, I just brought you in, okay? Proven. This quiet. This situation ain't my fault. I didn't make you kill no children. Did that woman take your balls? There, there. Settle in. Uh, guess that'll teach me to try to be civil with you. You got your man? At least Here's now you got money. some peace. If only they was all like this. being fought over by bounty hunters. Yeah, it's real peaceful. Peaceful life is crazy. You were paid to give false testimony. But this won't hold up in court. Ok, vamos a ver si nos da tiempo a hacer la última misión de hoy. Excuse me, sir. You work here? No, I just hang around here for fun. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. How can I help you, friend? I know this sounds crazy. Some dumb old coot, I know, is telling me there's these houses you can buy pre-cut. <laughs> Not crazy, friend. The very latest in modern convenience. Convenient and cost-efficient. <sighs> Which house do you want? <laughs> Each one is entirely unique, but also the same. Excuse me? Perhaps I'm going too fast, sir. Do you want to buy a house? I think so. I'll give you a luxurious, entirely unique pre-cut palace. And if you order today, I guarantee your home in a matter of weeks, maybe sooner. I'll take that one. Ah, yes, we have that one in stock. And I already got credit from the bank. Oh, fantastic. You write your name here, and uh, you sign your name there, and you will be the proud owner of a factory-built home. It's that easy. Pleasure to meet you, Mr. Martin. Albert Cakes, Esquire, at your service. You boys give me a minute. <sighs> What are you doing here? Everything okay? I'm not sure. Probably. A fella came by the farm. Got attacked on the road. He said the Skinner brothers was hanging around. Lots of them. I left Uncle armed to the teeth back at the ranch. Who are these two? Guns for hire. This Skinner's about we need them. We ain't got that kind of money, Charles. You want to get robbed for your house? No, but... Hey, these Skinner's gonna be nasty. Come on. Mr. Devin, you're with me. Mr. Wayne, this is... Milton. Jim Milton. Sir, good to meet you. We're gonna be heading up to the Manzanita Post. Why? The best smith around is that Norwegian fella up there. So they say. You boys ready? Yes, sir, we're ready. Good, because you're about to get shot at over a goddamn hammer. You want to build a house with a sniper rifle, then? I know old Neil's real well. I'll get you a good deal. Thank you, sir. All right, then. Let's go buy us some tools. I know the quickest way. Follow me. Hey, is your friend a Negro or a Redskin? I think a bit of both, for what it's worth. Cash is cash. 
So it's all the same to me. I saw you getting skittish there, but don't you worry. We're not getting shot at. Oh, yeah. I know Charles Smith. If he's got cause to be concerned, it's usually good cause. You got a shotgun messenger sitting right beside you, all right? Now, suppose you don't know much about robbing caravans. Not much, I guess. <laughs> no. Well, nor do I. But I know a thing or two about protecting them. And if a robber sees some strong men sitting up front, two of them guns behind, then they're gonna wait for the next set of fools to come on through. Unless they take the guns to mean they're carrying something valuable. Instead of pre-cut timber and some tools. What? No. Wait, the... Trust me on this. You are overthinking it. <laughs> you hire a gun, you hire peace of mind and a deterrence. So I'll sit here looking big and scary, and you can concentrate on the horses. All right. I'll do just that. Maybe I've done this kind of thing before, and maybe I can handle a weapon. But I'm not so different from you, partner. I think you might be. People wonder how you can handle it. Living by your gun. But it's the same as any other occupation, really. Hey, we're taking the next right up towards Manzanita Post. So, what were you saying? When I get home, I put my gun on the rack and it stays there. I mean it, it, it really stays there. I don't even think about it. My mind's on my wife and the little ones. I'm chopping wood, mending the roof, putting the kids to bed. But when I'm out here, I'm watching the tree line. I got my gun at the ready. And I'm trying to make my employer as comfortable as possible. That's, uh, real good of you. You're in good hands. I know this country well. Good. Am I finally gonna meet this tool maker? Now, Niels, he's an acquired taste, but boy, can he work metal. Norwegian, you see? Viking blood. Fellas up there used to worship a god with a hammer. Guess I figures they'd still be making them. I'm not sure how much English he speaks, but Niels knows tools. This is the spot, just up ahead. Okay. You boys wait here. After you, Mr. Mill. Senor. Nels, it's me. Willard Wayne. Okay. This is my associate, Jim Milton. Okay. He heard you was the best. Best smith around. He needs some tools. He's building a ranch house up at Beecher's Hope. Beecher's Hope? Okay. Have you got any made? Uh, okay. Like I said, an acquired taste, but a heart of gold, and he's the best. You off someplace, Nils? Okay. <clears throat> Typico. So Milton is uh, working with Cakes Hardwood and Timber in town. Should I get them to pay you and add it to his bill up there? Okay. Come on, let's get moving. Whew. Okay. <laughs> All right, then. Beecher's Hope. They've been trying to sell that property for some time, haven't they? Took a look at it myself, as it so happens. It seemed like a lot of work. Too much for me. But more power to you. Must have seen something in it I couldn't. No me había dado cuenta 
Eso me ha recordado al, a, a lo... ¡Señora! 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 Devin, you okay? Yes. That the last of them? I think so. There's more. They got the tools. They grabbed Mr. Wayne. All right, you stay here, go the way. Charles, come on. A ver, terminar voy a terminar. Ah, ah, vale, te refieres al juego. No, el juego no lo iba a terminar hoy. Yo dije que era el fin de Arthur. Dije que va a terminar el juego Claro, el final de Arthur se fue Creo que ya no va a arropar más a sus niños. Me da a mí. Tengo como un presentimiento. You knew what he was getting into. Did he? Skinner. Everyone knows. Except me. Later, John.
Charles, you all right carrying him? I got it. There's no use in you getting bloody too. Is he? Is it bad? They opened him up pretty good. Uh, nearly chopped his head in two. God damn them! Uh -huh. Mr. Wayne didn't make it. Dear Lord, no. We have to get out of here. You take him in the back wagon. Come on, help me. All right, let's get out of here. Oh my lord, what'd they do to him? Nothing nice. Got it? Come on, we gotta go. Shit. Those goddamn animals. Okay, John, I'm riding with you. Get us back to beaches. Those were the Skinner brothers. I told you I was worried. Sadie said something too. What kind of land have I bought? Horses won't go this fast for long. It's not the land. Skinners move around. They're here for now. I thought this... This kind of bloodshed was meant to be over with. Damn it, John. You'll run the horses into the ground. What was all the nonsense about civilization? This kind of bloodshed is different. Folks have been killed, sure. For good reason and bad. Uncle! Uncle! Uh, 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 Uncle! I was, uh, you useless sack of crap. I was keeping guard. Really? Whoa. What happened? Skinner Brothers. Bottom? Enough. Once this is done, I'll take Mr. Devon back to town and pull Mr. Wayne buried. Okay. Be careful. Oh, I will. But I'm fairly sure we scared him off for now. Bad business. Well, we'll be safe together. Sure. If you say so. And John, I love you. Don't you forget that. Okay. Pues ya lo tenemos. Pues ya hemos terminado. Por hoy. <ríe>